19, let's see, 80, 81, Sally Lilienthal comes to me and says, I want to start a foundation in San Francisco. Uh, her husband, Phil Lilienthal, mm -hmm. who was with the UC Berkeley Press, wonderful, wonderful mm -hmm. man. And Sally says, I'd like you to be on the board and we're going to get together to figure out what to do. She said, I've been giving money to international stuff, but I don't know where it's going. And I think there are a lot of people like me and I want to collect money and make sure it's going to the right place and do the research and and it, it'll be a kind of a collection of donors that'll give and will give their money away. So will you come on the board? So I come on, I go to the first meeting of the board. There are about seven of us. So I go to Sally's living room and we're sitting there on the sofa and I'm sitting next to a guy I'd never met before. And I'm introduced to him. Turns out his name was Owen Chamberlain. And I don't know what he does. And so I start to say something like, you know, what do you do for a living? And Sally grabs me or kicks me or does something and drags me away and says, he's got a Nobel Prize in physics at Berkeley. And I thought, boof. <laughs> you know, so anyway, we go back. To, and I remember, because I've told the story many times at board meetings afterwards, and when Owen was sick, he would still come to our meetings, and I'd still talk with him about it. We have a discussion. You know, there's civil, there are civil liberties problems all over the world. Sally's been with Amnesty International, trying to rescue journalists that have been imprisoned. Uh, you know, there's a, a hundred world problems. I've had nothing to do with them since my days in the Peace Corps, and that's why I signed up because I said to Sally, you know, I'd like to get back and learn something about foreign affairs. And we're, we're going and we're saying, well, what, what do we do? And what about this? And what about that? And at that point, Owen, one of the world's quietest people, quietly says, you know, there are a lot of problems in the world. I forget how he puts it. But he says, there's one that's so much bigger than all the others. It just dwarfs them, and that's nuclear weapons. And if we can't get rid of them, uh, we can destroy civilization. Well, I don't remember the details, but you know, there's a lot of silence. Mm -hmm. We're all, <laughs> you know, <laughs> that's it. Yeah. So there was so just kind of consensus. There was never, I don't think, ever any more discussion. Mm -hmm. We're in the nuclear arms control business. Yeah. That's what we'll do with plowshares. Mm 